Hi, welcome to the third tutorial of installing Asterisk on Ubuntu 10.04. So far, we have checked for Sifter system updates, we have installed all the required packages for the Asterisk, and uh, then we downloaded the packages from uh, the Asterisk website. Now, about the packages, there are four packages which uh, are installed when installing Asterisk. The first one is the DAHDI and uh, the third one is the the second one is the libri third there's asterisk and then the asterisk add-ons now you can download these packages while using wget command and giving the http links right after the wget command and the terminal will download the package you can download the packages in any any uh, uh, any place you want any drive you want uh, or you can use the drive which i'm using which is uh, home user and SRC. So we have downloaded the packages and we'll continue the third tutorial uh, while installing the four packages that we downloaded. First of all we download the HDI. Now the command which is used to untar the, the tar files or the zip file for Windows users is TARXVF. So I have that uh, package in my system first I have to go to that drive in which the package is present so I'm moving out on that so I have my package in this drive in this directory so I'll access that directory and uh, these are the four packages that you can see and you can see the extension which is tar.gz first of all you'll use the command tar file has been unzipped or untar and we'll then we'll move to our second package which is I can see when when we have untar this package this is a folder with the same name has been uh, made in the directory and this is the tar tar folder or the zip folder so secondly we'll uh, unzip the library similarly with the tar command tar xvf which has also been untarred and a folder has been created we do the same for the assets back You can see when we have untarred the four packages, four folders have been created in the same directory. And now we will install them one by one. So first of all, we'll have to move inside each of the folder. For example, if I'm installing DHDI, I have to move into that directory. the command make all and make install so I'll simply copy the command and uh, I can paste it there now it's installing that package So once the DHDI package is, has been st is installing, uh, after that we'll install the other packages. So, so that's what for this tutorial. Thank you very much.